I've just been like watching Himesh in awe, really, because he's there's something about him that is so. I mean, I remember when I met Danny Boyle and we were doing the scenes, and I said, "Well, who's going to be Jack Malik?" And he was like, "I can't say yet, but his eyes kind of lit up, and he was like, I've found someone, and he is just brilliant." And and I could see, and he couldn't say who, and I and I was like, "Oh my, you know," and then working with him, with Himesh in rehearsals and stuff and seeing, it was like he is Jack. He has this kind of, he sort of like lets the music come out through him in such a pure, honest way. Um, and his voice is so incredible. And it really does sound like that early Beatles sound. Like you could hear his voice would harmonize in, <laughs> into the Beatles perfectly. To be in a film he's written, to be around him every single day and to become, you know, friends with this person who I just think is such a genius in his writing and, and, and how he weaves stories together and creates characters and makes the audience root and for the people in the film and long for uh, to be in the film and to just... and and. Uh, captures what's like true and good and hopeful about life. I think what Danny Boyle's been so brilliant is capturing is that feeling of the early Beatles, of the, that kind of them running around and the joke and the humor and the kind of that spark that they had, which the whole world just fell in love with. That Beatle fever, you know, it was, um, it's so wonderful for us. And there's a, um, me, Alex and Himesh, um, Alex who plays Gavin, the, um, our kind of producer in the studio, when we're getting to like play, listen to the songs and record the songs and do the hand clap and have the tambourine and like feel like we were the Beatles creating this music. It was just like one of the best days filming I've ever had. It was so much fun.